So, this is paradise. If you can afford. Gentlemen, glad to hear you made it out of New York. Where are we? Olivia decrypted the Data 47 recovered from the bank. We isolated three transactions from Providence partner accounts. All made out to Haven, a small corporation operating out of the Maldives. And what does Haven do? To the public, they specialize in reputation management for the rich and famous. The real money, however, comes from the covert reconstruction of identities for wealthy criminals. They make people disappear. The partners are using Haven to acquire new identities. Yes. Olivia's been attempting to hack the Haven servers, but the owners of Haven are manually resetting the access keys every 10 hours. That, unfortunately, makes them targets. Haven Island is a true tropical paradise. Owned by the company's founder, Tyson Williams, the island is used by Haven as a combined headquarters and client entertainment center. Current and potential clients are ferried to the island and treated to the very best the Maldives have to offer. Michelin star chefs, a full massage spa, private huts, exercise facilities, and all the comforts of a luxury island resort are made available to them. 47. We'll be sending you in as a potential new client. We've put together a convincing cover story. You're Mr. Reaper, a thief for hire looking to disappear for a while. Your mission on the island is simple. You need to eliminate the three owners of Haven. Tyson Williams, founder and rumored tyrannical CEO of Haven. Ludmilla Vitrova, a former confidence artist hired by Williams to serve as a client recruiter and handler. And Stephen Bradley, technical wizard and the brains behind Haven's proprietary software platform. With the owners gone, Olivia will be able to penetrate the Haven servers long enough for her to secure the new partner identities. I've uploaded all the information we have on the island and the three targets. Best of luck, gentlemen. Hmm. I don't rely on luck. Well, a little wouldn't hurt. Welcome to the Maldives, 47. The Haven Island staff is ready to receive you under your assumed identity as Tobias Reaper, a professional thief looking to retire from a life of crime. Ludmilla Vitrova can be found in the public sections of the island primarily tending to client needs. Stephen Bradley alternates between looking after a strict training regimen and working on a small private island. While Tyson Williams roams his large villa estate at the back of the island. This is it, 47. Eliminating the three owners of Haven should buy Miss Hall the time needed to do a full penetration and retreat of the problem Best of luck, 47. Mr. Reaper, is it not? Welcome to Haven. Thank you. Are you one of the owners? Yes, indeed. I'm Ludmila Vitrova, co-owner of Haven and your gracious host for this day. 
I suspect we'll be seeing more of each other today. Oh, I'm sure of that, Miss Petrova. Wonderful. Your late booking has me intrigued. In the meantime, our staff will take good care of your needs. Thank you, Miss Petrova. Come find me when you're ready, Mr. Reaper. I think we have lots to talk about. If you haven't been to your hut yet, I highly recommend it. There's a letter there for you, which you may find interesting. Thank you, Miss Fatrova. Mr. Reaper! Welcome to Haven Island. Oh, please collect your key to the private hut in the Welcome Center. Okay, enjoy your stay! Mr. Reaper, welcome to Haven. Here is the key for your personal hut. Um, it's the one behind you on the right. Oh, and Miss Fatrova asked me to tell you that she has left a personal message for you in your hut. Have a good day, sir. Reaper, I hope you enjoy your stay here. Oh, if there's anything you need, please don't hesitate to ask. I'm here at your service. A note from Ludmilla Vitrova. I wonder what she wants from you, 47. Regardless, it would be a shame to keep her waiting. Miss Vitrova. It's Tobias Reaper. I read your note. Excellent. I reviewed your file prior to your arrival, and I found it very intriguing. I have an offer for you. If you're interested, you can find me over at the restaurant. I'll keep it in mind. Wonderful. I hope to see you there. sir. Mr. Reaper, so good to see you. You mentioned an offer. Yes, it's a little embarrassing, but we've had an incident. Hello, sir. A theft. The thief is an employee here, a person working in Mr. Williams's villa at the other end of the island. What was stolen? A USB drive containing some sensitive information. Personal information, which I would rather not fall into the hands of others. So, my offer is this. Obtain the USB drive from the thief without alerting anyone at the villa. The thief is likely still there. 
I can't get you inside, so you'll have to use that particular skill set of yours to gain access. Do that, and I'll convince Mr. Williams to give you a 50% discount on our service fee. That's a million dollars, Mr. Reaper. A generous offer. The information must be valuable. Mostly to me. It's very personal. Please call me as soon as you've recovered it. Very well. I'll call you. Fine day, sir.
voicemail again? Yes, hello. We kind of want to be left alone. Do you mind? Mr. Williams isn't uh, looking too great. Do you think it's serious? What, like malaria or something? We all got shot before coming here. Mr. Williams, I understand you were looking for this. My USB drive. Finally, some good news. And the thief? Taken care of. Good. Good. I like you. Come with me. I'd like to personally reward you for your good work. Safe. Change the pin code. All right. That's that. I'll wire a handsome reward to your personal account, my friend. Or maybe... You know what? I have a better idea. Well, Mike, I guess at least one person in my security detail isn't a complete failure. This man just brought me my stolen item. You got anything to say for yourself? I, uh, I guess he got lucky. Lucky? Lucky? You get your things and get out of my sight! I guess you just got promoted a personal bodyguard. Thank you. 
Mr. Williams. Well, Mike's been getting on my nerves for months now. The man's got no sense of personal space, you know? This promotion is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity for you. Make the most of it. Rest assured, Mr. Williams. I will. Good man. Your new outfit's in that locker behind you. I'm just gonna do some work in here for a while. Alone. Make sure nobody comes in. Yes, sir, Mr. Williams. Tyson Williams eliminated. Excellent work, 47. Two targets remaining. Hello, sir. Miss Vitrover, I've acquired the item you wanted. Should we meet? Yes, absolutely. Come to the spa over by the pool area. I've been curating those handbags for the better part of a decade. <gasps> what the hell? Nothing here.
I'm Mr. Reaper. I have an appointment. Ah, yes, Mr. Reaper. You can go right in. Miss Petrova is waiting for you inside. Have a good time. Oh, nice outfit, Mr. Reaper. I see you're already doing what you can to fit in. Follow me. Well, let's see where this ends, shall we? Damn, look at that. Laser focused. You, leave us. You have the item with you. Can I have it, please? Here you are. Ah, oh, thank you so much, Mr. Reaper. I can't tell you how much this means to me, Mr. Reaper. I'm afraid things aren't quite as serene here as they may seem on the surface. I'm slowly beginning to understand that. Tyson, Mr. Williams, he's not well. Hasn't been for some time. We used to be together, but his illness... I couldn't take it anymore. <sighs> I don't know why I'm telling you this. He monitors my every move. I think he asked that girl to steal my information because he wants to... I don't know... Punish me? Kill me? Who knows anymore? Sounds hard. You have no idea. I... I sometimes wish he'd just disappear, you know? Vanish from the face of the planet. And then I'd be free. Anyway, I shouldn't bore you with my personal problems. You've been very helpful, and I will honor my promise and make sure that you get the discount. Perhaps we'll see each other at dinner one of these nights. One-on-one, -on -one, maybe. One-on-one -on -one sounds ideal. Excellent. Well, Hey, what the- Ugh! Good work, 47. Ludmilla Vitrova has been permanently retired. Just one more target to go.
is Stephen Bradley, notorious hacker, chief programmer at Haven, and rumored to be quite reckless in his behavior. Hello, sir. Look, I'm really dying for a ride in that water skin. 